Just to let you guys know, we are not financial advisors. We took the time to research on the internet, the place you should or could be making in the near future. Welcome to A Crowd of Stocks. Today is Wednesday. Here's our top five stocks on the move. First up is Society Pass, ticker symbol SOPA, average volume 19.32 million, 52 week high 77.34, 52 week low 3.27. It develops, sells, and distributes hardware and software through a point of sale system. At the time of this recording, it was up 53% at 16.05. The CEO was Dennis Wynn, founded in 2018 in Carson City, Nevada. Next up is Cygnus Sports United, ticker symbol SSU, average volume 238,107. 52 week high 11.40, 52 week low 6.97. It engages in operation of an e commerce platform for sporting goods and apparel. At the time of this recording, it was up 24% at 9.25. The CEO is Steven Zoll, founded in 2020 in Berlin. Next up is Wejo Group, ticker symbol WEJO, average volume 691,127, 52 week high 19.90, 52 week low 4.65. It operates as a data exchange platform through connected car data. At the time of this recording, it was up 23 percent at 6.74 the ceo is richard michael barlow located in hamilton hamilton city next up is lottery.com ticker symbol ltry average volume 824,139 52-week high 17.50 52-week low 4.61 it provides domestic and international lottery products and services at the time of this recording it was up 20 percent at 6.63 ceo is lawrence anthony diamato located in new york new york next up is isoplexus ticker symbol iso average volume for 491,498, 52-week high, 16.95, 52-week low, 4.71. It develops curative medicines and personalized therapeutics. At the time of this recording, it was at 18% at 8.16. The CEO is Sean McCain, founded in 2013 in Bradford, Connecticut, with 232 employees. This is A Crowd of Stocks, A Crowd of Stocks across all social media, acrowdofstocks.com. Again, we are not your financial advisors. Hopefully you guys can look into these people. Hopefully some of this is good advice. Hopefully this is something that you guys can see that you can use in the near future.